Hey, Mike Ashcroft here with Christians Get Rich. Today I want to talk about soothing and shielding. So if you've had anxiety in your life or some sort of trauma, there are Ill illegitimate ways to cope with that. It might be alcohol, it might be drugs, it might be the party lifestyle. And so you have a hurt and you're trying to uh, put some sort of balm on that hurt to take away the pain. And so you're soothing it. Or you don't want to deal with the pressures of reality. You have a hard time coping with your circumstance. Let's say you didn't have one or both parents in your childhood. And so this left you with some emotional deficits in your life. And so you don't want to deal with the stresses and hardships of life because uh, challenges come in like waves in the sea, one after another, and that's life. And so you kind of want to shield yourself from these hurts. So soothing and shielding can be taking drugs, it can be medicating, so many things. But if you do that, you're not fixing the problem. In fact, you're making the problem worse. You're, you're perpetuating it and at the same time you're worsening it and very likelihood you're adding another problem on top of the problem so you went to drug use to find some sort of escape from your problems and so the problems don't go away but you add another problem on it because now you have addiction and you're wasting your money and your time away and so instead of soothing and shielding you need to get into uh uh, healing and helping so you need to heal from all those hurts and you need to help your life and so what you need to do is rise and face those challenges stand up and face the waves and take it wave after wave after wave because the more we face those waves the stronger we become in life and as we become stronger in life we become successful so if you just give into the waves and let yourselves be carried by the waves in with the tide and out with the tide until you're just drowning on a sea of forgetfulness that is not the type of imposing yourself against life to the point of succeeding and overcoming and triumphing and finding prosperity so um for me, you know, part of the solution has been being a Christian, but also just having the the courage to face each day. The Bible says, uh, don't worry about the troubles of tomorrow. Each day has its own troubles to worry about. And so it's just one day at a time, rise to the challenge, do the tasks that are at hand. Don't worry about tomorrow ta tomorrow's tasks, but don't put off today's tasks because you're worrying about tomorrow's task. Do today's task, do the best you can, ask God to help you and heal and help instead of soothing and shielding. I hope that's a little bit of therapy for you. If you were helped by this video, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. We'll see you next time on Christians Get Rich.